Hey guys, my name is Pascal, I'm with Bisplay.com and today I'm excited to show you the new Intel NUC Core i5. We received it over the weekend and we're going to show you how you can easily install your own memory module in it um, and the really small Wi-Fi adapter, a Intel Centrino 6235. So we're going to show you how to mount that so that you can easily use it for bisplay.com or anything else you'd like to do with it yourself. We're opening up this box with this nice little sound. Very cool. And we have the Intel NUC right here. To get out of the package. And yeah, well, let's see. Start by opening it up. Okay, we'll remove the screws first. Loosen them already a little bit. Let's see. Here we go. That's the nook inside. And the next step is going to be to mount the memory modules. Okay, we'll start by mounting the uh, memory module in there. There's only one way that you can put it in. Slide it in carefully. There we go. And it clicks, there you go. And the next one, put it in there, push gently, and it clicks. Okay, cool, that's it. Okay, so next we're gonna install the Intel Centrino 6235 uh, Wi-Fi module. It needs to go down there, but before we can do that, we need to remove that little screw over here. So we're going to do that. And it's needed to fasten the module once it is installed. Yeah. That's one. And then a tiny screw goes there. Lovely. So that's that. And next we need to install these two antenna cables fix them onto the module and uh, this one the gray one goes on the left hand side It's a bit fiddly, but there we go. That's one, and the other one goes down here. And it snaps on as well. And there you go, we're done. We can close them up and we're ready to roll. Okay, so I got the NUC all set up. I connected it to a television set. Um, I got the uh, HDMI cable running into the television, and I got the power adapter uh, here. And I'm going to boot from this USB stick that I created with the Bisplay plug and player, and that boots immediately to a web browser which we need for Bisplay to run. Put it in there, and I'll start the NUC. And as it starts in the background, I'm briefly going to tell you one of the drawbacks I think of the NUC is that it doesn't come with a standard uh, power cable, so you would still need to uh, have your own power cable and run it into that three point uh, connector right there. And this takes a couple of seconds, so we're going to fast forward uh, to the point where the browser starts up. So we're now at the point where the browser just started up, and here you can see our page loading, so it immediately connects to the internet, Wi-Fi is working, and there you go. The Intel log. Core i5 is running and running smoothly, as you can see right there. I hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments or send us a quick note on info at bisplay.com. Thanks, guys.